Hello there and welcome. My name is Dr. Farhan Khawaja, PhD, or just Doc Farhan. You're watching this video because you may already be taking testosterone boosting supplements or herbs, or you are interested in taking them in the future. And you may also be aware that testosterone is the most essential male hormone. It helps in boosting your sex drive and performance in the bedroom, having more energy and drive, getting harder and stronger erections, and of course, getting those muscle gains at the gym. So clearly, testosterone is very important for overall health in men. And taking testosterone herbs and supplements can be very beneficial to you. That being said, this video will help you determine the safety and effectiveness of testosterone boosting supplements. Are they safe for you or not? Now, there are a lot of great testosterone boosting supplement companies out there, including ours, but there are also some very bad companies out there with very poor quality supplements that will do you more harm than good. So that is why I'm making this video to share with you the four key facts that you must, must understand before taking any testosterone supplement out there. But before I tell you these four key facts, let me be transparent with you and tell you about my story. So back in 2013, I had just finished my PhD in neuroscience from McGill University. Just seven days after defending my thesis and my dissertation, I moved to Las Vegas. There, I started working for a company called Real Social Dynamics. We were teaching men how to pick up girls, how to date girls. Why did I make such a crazy jump? You see, even though I had stellar academic performance and I was a good, nice guy, my parents were happy, my religion, my culture, my relatives, they were all happy. But inside was a completely different story. I had no energy, no purpose, no libido, no muscle mass, and worst of all, I could not perform in the bedroom. It was embarrassing. Imagine being in Las Vegas, surrounded by some of the most stunning girls in the world, and I was bringing these girls home to have sex with, but I could not perform, I could not get hard, I had limp dick every single time. I could not have sex with them. It was that bad. Eventually though, I'd had enough. I had to figure out what was going on inside me. So I brought in my science nerd and I started reading everything I could about testosterone. What foods to eat, what training to do, what are the different testosterone herbs and supplements out there that I could take? You see, Initially, when I had my testosterone levels checked, they were 376 nanograms per deciliter. That's the testosterone levels of an 82-year-old man. And what made matters even worse is that after reading these journals, I found out that testosterone levels don't get any better. After the age of 30, testosterone levels can drop up to 2% in men. So if I didn't fix that problem right away, the depression was only going to get worse and worse. This was my problem. And that's when my testosterone transformation began. After seeing the harsh reality, I started experimenting with everything. Testosterone herbs and supplements and what to eat and how to train. I even moved to St. Petersburg, Florida to train with one of my mentors, Elliot Hulse, at strength camp. After doing self-experimentation and tons and tons of trial and error, I was finally getting results. I had learned what works and what doesn't. I was able to double my testosterone levels. They have gone from 376 nanograms per deciliter and now they are 770 nanograms per deciliter. I have not only doubled my total testosterone, but also my free testosterone. And to top it all off, my bioavailable testosterone is so high that it is above the reference range 
of bioavailable testosterone. Now, what have been the benefits for me in doubling my testosterone levels? The biggest, biggest one is my sex drive. It is literally through the roof. I'm having more sex than ever before and the quality of sex has been amazing. And of course, my girlfriends are loving those results as well. But these benefits are not just inside the bedroom. I have more energy than I've ever had just day to day. I'm running a company and of course training at the gym all the time. It's like doing this, I have an edge over everyone else. It has been a life changer. So right now, I wanna pass on the key learnings that I've had in my life so you don't make the same mistakes I made. Trust me, man. I've gone through a lot of pain, a lot of trial and error, and I wanna pass on those key facts to you so you get the results as soon as possible. And as I said earlier, before you try any testosterone supplement out there, you must watch this video. Let's get started. So, key fact number one. You must know about every single ingredient inside the herbs you're taking. Let me give you an example. This right here is a list of 36 ingredients that are in a testosterone booster pill that this patient was taking. He came to the ER experiencing abdominal pain and when they stopped this supplement from his regimen, the pain went away and his symptoms went away. So you need to be very, very careful because these ingredients, most of them are harmful to you. They are designed in a lab. There are no human clinical trials proving that they work. So be very careful. Fact number two, do not trust Amazon reviews. They've done studies with the top five testosterone boosters that are sold on amazon.com. They've looked at those reviews and they found that when you look at the erection quality reviews, the libido reviews, the sexual performance reviews, and even some of the muscle gain reviews, 80 to 90% of those reviews are from fake sources. This is the way you can verify a certain review or testimonial is accurate and authentic. You must know the people who are reviewing these supplements. You must know them. You must know who they are. That is literally the only way that you can verify that a certain testosterone herb or supplement is going to be effective and work for you and that it will be safe and high quality. Fact number three, if you decide to take testosterone injections where you're pumping in exogenous testosterone into your body, then you may have to take it forever because your body may stop the natural production of testosterone. Listen, man, Mother Nature has given us everything we need to heal ourselves, to become the best versions of ourselves. So if you do decide to go and do testosterone injections, and you're unable to sleep, you're unable to focus, you get these jitters, do you really want that? It's very unsustainable, man. And fact number four, this may be the most important. Skin in the game, S-I-T-G. Skin in the game means, are these herb manufacturer people, are they taking the herbs themselves? That is how you know if you can trust them or not. All right. Now I'm gonna give you a quick recap. One, know the ingredients. Two, don't trust Amazon reviews or other reviews unless you know the person who's doing the review and can trust that person. Three, be very careful about taking testosterone injections or any synthetic testosterone stuff out there. <laughs> and four, make sure there is skin in the game from that testosterone company that is selling you the testosterone boosting herb. Now I'm gonna give you some final words to end this video and some statistics which will scare you and definitely shock you. First, let's look at it intuitively. Do you not see that masculinity is under attack? Just in the last 20 or 30 years, do you not see how men have become weaker? 
how obesity levels are at all-time highs. If you look at just testosterone levels, if you compare a man, just take one average man 20 years ago, his testosterone levels, and then you look at a man today, the same age, his testosterone levels are 25% lower when you look at total testosterone. Then you look at a man 20 years ago and you compare his bioavailable testosterone to a man today. Remember, you're matching the ages. It's the same age, a 30-year-old 20 years ago versus a 30-year-old today, a 50-year-old 20 years ago versus a 50-year-old today. The bioavailable testosterone is 45% lower today. Are these not shocking you? Now let's look at erectile dysfunction and porn addiction statistics. If you look at just porn addiction and you look at the ages 18 to 30, it has been found that a third of those men are chronically addicted to porn. And if you look at overall, all men, the percentage is 18%. It is that high. Now let's look at ED, erectile dysfunction. Now again, this is a survey study when they look at men in their 30s, they find that over 50% have problems with erections. And if you look at men under 30, it is about 33% who have problems with erections. It is a terrible time that we live in right now. And you know what, men? The sad part? We're all worried about what's happening. Parents, lovers, physicians, relatives, friends, everyone is worried. Even the American Psychological Association, we're all worried that this epidemic that we're suffering from, it's gonna end more relationships in the future. It's gonna affect mental health even more in the future. It's gonna affect intimacy even more in the future. It's just gonna get worse and worse, man. And you know what, man? Even sperm quality is being negatively affected by our environment. Sperm count, sperm volume, sperm motility, sperm morphology are all depleting in men. And guess what? Testosterone makes sperm. Testosterone right now is more important than ever before. And if you take the wrong testosterone supplements, it can do you more harm than good. Look, man, at the end of the day, this is your body. It is your life. Do not take shortcuts to save a few bucks here and there. The risks are not worth it. So that's it, man. I hope this video helped you a lot. If you want to learn more about testosterone herbs specifically and the herbs that I take every day, how to boost testosterone naturally without any side effects, I've recorded another video for you. The link should be down below somewhere. Click on it and I'll see you in the next video.